Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to run our app on an Android emulator. I'm assuming that you have already installed and set up Android Studio on your computer and that you have also created an Android virtual device. If you haven't done so, you can check out this guide which will help you set up your development environment for Android whether you're using a Mac, Windows or Linux. So just follow through this guide and create your virtual device. If you don't have the code for the app, you can just clone this repo or also leave this link in the description box. So these are the minor adjustments we're going to do to our app uh, to make it run on an Android emulator. So to start, I'm just going to copy the same code that we have inside our index.ios.js just gonna copy all this and paste it inside index.android.js and save so it will be the same code running on iOS and on Android then the next thing we need to do is to go inside our android manifest.xml so this can be found inside Android app source main and Android manifest. So I'm just gonna copy the user permissions which will allow us to access the location. Then I need to also use uh, I need to also add the metadata with our API key just paste it down here and the next thing we need to do is go inside our main application java and import react native maps now you don't need to follow this step if you used react native link when you're installing react native maps so I'm just gonna copy this go inside java com taxi app and inside my main application to Java I'll just import it up here and save then down here I need to add new maps package and save this Then inside settings.gradle I need to add this code so I'm just going to copy this and go inside my settings.gradle and I'll just add this few lines of code and save inside my build.gradle I'm just going to copy this and add it at the bottom here and save and I'll just open a new terminal so I can run my Android emulator so if you have installed if you have set up your virtual device you can just list all your virtual devices by Tapping in this command, let me just copy this and paste it. So, so it will show me all the virtual devices I have on my computer. So I have Nexus 5X. So I'm just going to run this command. To start my emulator. This is 24. You can also run it directly from Android Studio. Okay, so my emulator is running. 
so the next thing you want to do is you want to click on this icon and make sure you add your location I've already added mine so you can add yours and just click send and close this this will be the location which will be used by the app as your current location I'm just gonna close this and inside my terminal just going to open another window and cd into my taxi app and run react native run android and this would this may take some time just have to wait okay guys so as you can see we have the same code running on our android device and we also have the same code running on our ios device so that's it guys thanks for watching i'll be doing more tutorials like this and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't done so already i'll see you in the next videos Bye bye